Games, games, games. Welcome back. Let's go Eevee episode six. Last time we went in here and beat a bunch of rocket grunts and Giovanni. And today's objective is to tackle this gym and then some. My plan is to just spam this move because it's a psychic gym. Okay, time to go. Surprise while the glitz and glam. I am. I'll need to have a Pokemon at least level 45 if I want to stand a hands. Well, do I have one? I do, actually. How many trainers will we fight today? That's the real question. It seems we found our first one. Or he just turns away. That's great, too. I didn't want to send out Ushio. Whoops. Guess we're going to have to switch that out. Ah. Oh, it did only half. Interesting. And now Kadabra. I foresaw this. Imagine I just jumped straight to the gym. That'd be so funny. Yeah, it figures. <laughs> guess we're just gonna have to battle our way a bit more. Oh, I forgot to switch out again. That was my bad. Oh, I guess I must be on the right path if I'm encountering trainers. Wow, I G dodged a bullet. I'm honestly not sure what constitutes to be good content on this area, because again, I'm still new to this uh, Let's Play stuff. This is actually the only one I've really consistently done, consistently with an asterisk. I I, I did it again. Fudge. <laughs> Note to self: Don't forget to switch. I don't know where I'm going right now. I'm just going to be honest with that. But that's the point with these teleporters. You're not supposed to know where you're supposed to go. It's just a game of guessing. Oh, I forgot to switch. Note to self, don't forget to switch. That's really stupid. I told myself, note to self, don't forget to switch. Forgets to switch anyway. Not for content. I just flat out forgot. <laughs> yeah, hypnosis, of course. We'll shake it off though, right? Okay, well, we're fine. We're not taking any substantial damage. Yeah, woke up. Whoa, bye. All right, switch that out. Oh, are we there? Let's go. The plan is really simple. Just spam bite. I had a vision of your arrival. I have set... <laughs> yeah. I have had psychic power since I was a child. It started when I carelessly threw a spoon aside and... It bent itself in an unnatural shape. Sabrina is flat out evil in the original Pokemon anime, if you've seen it. It's kind of messed up. Battle time! Bye. Oh, didn't expect it to be that ineffective. We're fine, though. We're fine. We'll just be with only Eevee. Aha. Uh -huh. We'll be okay. Use bite again. Okay, quick attack. Clap. Next up is the Slumbro. Chop. Oh, wow. That did barely anything. Oh, right. Because they had to reflect. Duh. Chomp again. How much does this do? Oh, that's a lot more. Yeah. Oh, flinch. Mm. Didn't matter. Wake up. No. Oh, that's going to hurt. Nah, we're, we're good. We could take one more, right? We could take one more. We'll take the gamble. <laughs> well, 07. 07. Ooh. Do any of my other Pokemon have bite? Let's see, Swift, uh, no, that won't do. Jilt, no, not Jolteon either. So I guess we're really just gonna have to solo this. Give it a Hyper Potion. It's probably gonna use Surf again. Yeah, I use Surf. No big deal, no big deal. We'll awaken now, right? Yeah. Let's go. There's honestly no reason I should be hyped about this. <laughs> and anyway, since Jinx is coming out, we're gonna have to burn it to bits. I did not expect to use another one of the evolutions tonight. Tonight, it's the middle. I'm filming this in the middle of the day. Okay, sure. It, yeah, it's basically. Wait, it's faster. Shadow Ball will kill it. And last up is Alakazam. You just Shadow Ball it, right? Oh, Nightshade. What do you do? How much is that gonna do? Oh, 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 well, we're gonna have to heal this turn for sure. It's still out speed, so it's fine. We're fine. It didn't crit. If it crit, then we would have lost Rick Toad. And yeah, that was easy. My victory has earned me a marsh badge. Yay. So now that we are done with that, we are gonna make our way to Cinnabar Island. Bye bye. I just remember, do I need that other secret technique? I do. It's a bit of a problem. Should be in Celadon City, right? But simply, I'm wrong. I'll be completely honest. I don't know where I'm supposed to go to get that move right now. That's the thing with Pokemon games from this era. You know what needs to be done, but you don't know how to get there. <laughs> the whole process in itself. Wait, do I have you? Wait, amazing throw. Hey, what the heck? Why is it going that way? Yeah, uh, this way. Ah, uh, first chance failed. First chance, first catch. Good enough. Eat berry. Oh no. Oh, come on. That was a waste. Oh, there's another one though. There we go. Now eat this. 
There we go. First try. Apparently I didn't have them, so good catch. Now I have something actually worthwhile, including in the video, and not just cutting about 30 minutes of unused footage. I have to do that sometimes for these videos. It's just one segment between two cuts, and it's absolutely insane sometimes. The thing is with my videos is that I'm not the best at commentary while doing games. For this kind of thing, I usually just say something, cut to about a few seconds later and then don't talk for about five ten minutes that's just how i talk or at least that's how i film these things but one thing i do want to say though is that hopefully by the time this video comes out i would have at least filmed the first episode for the sonic and shadow generations video of course i'll tackle shadow generations first because i know that's what you guys want to see sonic generations is an old game so it's not exactly something you can just be excited about to watch again but i did hear that maybe a couple things changed about the main story so i'll be looking forward to that and we'll play that in the latter half so for that game i'm not going to do what i've been doing with the ev series i'm going to try to do like a huge chunk at once film the entire thing and then edit that entire thing it's gonna be a monster to edit given that i like to do a different style of videos i'm not exactly like oh fast pace everything even though it was kind of fast paced right at the start i want you guys to enjoy this style of editing i would call smell the flowers editing put simply it's like smelling the flowers i'm, I'm kidding i'm kidding but i I mean by that is kind of a slower way of editing that allows you to enjoy the moment that's the editing style i want you guys to enjoy and maybe i don't know grab a few hints for your own videos assuming you're making some where's this gosh darn move tutor ricto no one's blocking you you can ride on lapras if you use this you're gonna where i've been searching for way too long i'm just gonna... okay i'm dumb I'm, I'm actually just dumb. So what I failed to do is talk to the guy with the Lapras over here. I'm so stupid. I walked past in the last episode, but it just, I just didn't see it. And Evie can now ride a surfboard. Now we can do this. We can proceed. I don't know how long we're in with the actual edited video, but finally we're on our way. And since we're going to battle a lot of water Pokemon and probably catch a lot of water Pokemon, why are you coming straight toward me? Well, I guess we're going to start catching some Pokemon just to fill up that Dex. Of course, the first try doesn't work. Third time's a charm, right? Wait. Good enough. Third time's a charm. Let me get you. Wow. 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 Another, another poorly timed throw. Now we get you. And you as well. Brilliant. Figured. Second time. Okay, well. And good. Wow. That. Why did I do that? I'm not doing it for content. It's just happening. Since we're going to be battling a lot of water trainers, we're going to make sure Raikou's up front. Oh, look, it's Wade. You know, the guy from the Sonic movie. It's fitting that he thinks that Magikarps are strong, actually. What's he going to have? Six Magikarp? That'd be funny. Number two, three, four, five. Okay, yeah, he has six Magikarp. I thought there was going to be a troll at the end with the sixth one being Gyarados, but no. It's all Magikarp. This guy is literally weighed in an alternate dimension where he thinks that Magikarp is the strongest Pokemon. Funny enough, this fisherman Ronald here actually has that Gyarados, which it's dead. I'm going to Cinnabar Island and this person wants to coach me. Wait, what's a Machoke doing? That's random. Actually, wait, that's what coach trainer. That's what coach trainers are supposed to do. Try a Thunderbolt. That'll maybe work. Oh yeah, that's fine. She's pulling out a Jinx next, which means we gotta use Rikito. Someone in the comments I know is about to have a heck of a time with this. Yeah. She must kill it, but still. Weird. Oh, come. Mm. Wake up, 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 wake up. Ah. Second time's a charm, right? Wake up, wake up. Now it woke up. And bam, 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 it's dead. Kangas Khan is the next. Uh, you know what? We'll just pull out Ushio for this one. You know, it's funny. I'm at my dorm recording this right now. And my roommate's here. I wonder if he's all right with the fact that I'm just yelling like some kind of weird. It doesn't matter that we usually take great lengths to do this kind of stuff. That's what we do with YouTubers. Ooh, YouTubers. I just spit all over my screen. <laughs> This tentacle is just following me wherever I go. You're totally not suspicious. Oh, you just disappeared though. I'm not gonna lie, sometimes I genuinely don't know what to do for these things. It's just me grinding, and I know you guys don't want to see that because that's pretty boring. I just wanted to ask while I've been going around, how does an Eevee and a trainer move around on a surfboard without any waves? Is that what they mean by secret technique? Is you can just move it with your mind? 
Am I psychic? Anyway, we're here. One of the first things I'm gonna do is heal because I haven't done anything besides battles for like last 20 25 minutes i'll have to check in the footage for that one one of the things that's going on in my head right now is figuring out how do i edit this video as you guys may already know i edit the videos i make by myself i don't really have any outside help so as i'm playing i'm like literally trying to figure out all right how do i edit this part how do i edit this part maybe that's one of the reasons i can't commentate as well in these videos because i'm thinking about how do i edit this part i want to edit this video as well as i can because honestly some of these series videos have done well especially the first two and i really appreciate that but in the more modern ones they kind of declined overall the third one was the worst and honestly i can see why i hate that title and thumbnail i am gonna change at some point in the meantime i found this fossil guy and here's a helix fossil and we got ammonite i was gonna say if you guys are enjoying this series and interested in can and if you guys are interested in supporting this channel you guys are more than welcome to like the video and subscribe to channel i know you're tired of hearing me say that but that's just part of what happens when you watch youtube you're supposed to subscribe so do it i've been working really hard on my editing style for videos when i've had the time please help the channel i'm really trying to make it grow am i begging i am actually i'm sorry before we tackle the gym i want to take a look at the pokemon mansion here see if we can get a any cool catches here do i have wheezing we why is it never the first try why there we go play nice there we go i don't have you either ready throw nice throw good job actually that was first try and now i regret saying that earlier magmar 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 do i have it no i don't so i guess it's uh time to let him swipe then throw it and maybe get it figures oh no ah surely another one will appear right <laughs> hey Behind a gate. Ooh, item. Secret. Oh, there's a magma. And throw. <laughs> what else have I yet to find in here? Why is that thing's eyes red? Secret switch? Ah, okay. What it did was open this gate. That led me to... That's actually pretty good. I've explored this floor, so it's time to go upstairs. Ooh, secret switch here. Right... And the gate opens somewhere. There's a trainer in here. And oh, no, that's not a trainer, it's a burglar, but you get the idea. Take him down. Oh, he has a rapid dash. I gotta switch up for Ushio, but Riker can take him out, right? Sign down, boy. Oh, yeah, easy. Sad face. What's this ladder here? That's interesting. Wherever it goes, it must go to the third floor, but I think on the outside there was only two floors, so that's a little bit deceptive. We need another secret switch. Oh my gosh, he just ran into me. Oh, well. Beat down imminent. Use a Sandal Bolt. Almost dead. Something tells me there's a lot of fire trainers in here. Because, you know, this is also the home of the fire gym. So we'll probably just swap out Ushio here. Never mind. It's swapped out from Mac, Which means Eevee. And now to induce epilepsy warning. Not good enough. Ooh, disabling my psychic move. That was smart. I just bite you instead. <laughs> that was a weirdly timed place to lose my voice. Quick attack! I wonder if the secret I'm looking for has to be on this floor. Doesn't seem to have to do anything with those pillars. Ah! Oh, chasing! Okay. Even the AI of the Pokemon is like, let's chase him! Let's beat him! Actually, no, I figured it out. It's on the second floor because I have to return the gates I went in earlier to their original position. Which means that the one up here is open. We've made progress. We've made progress. What do you want? You just send out fire Pokemon, now it's rock Pokemon, but that's fine. Yet another ground type, so that means we're gonna use yet another water move. Why is he faster? So now we just gotta kill this this turn with an electric shot. Bye. On to the next section of uncharted territory. Oh, yeah. I'm blocked in. I'm blocked in. This magma just blocked me in. What am I supposed to do? Ah, these Pokemon are wild, wild, man. They're not just wild Pokemon. They're wild, wild Pokemon. All right, so these doors are swapped. I didn't mean to say swapped, but just more, oh, well, these doors go here. I didn't, what am I saying? Huh? We're gonna walk through. <laughs> okay, 
Okay, that's funny. That is actually funny. He stopped right in front of the coughing, and now he can just pose it like, who are you? There shouldn't be anyone here, including coughings. Epilepsy warning. Now there's a basement floor. We're gonna have to check that in a little bit, but I wanna see what's in this room. What's he doing alone? Uh, Magmar. Whoops. You know, I gotta say, within all this time I've played with all the evolutions, I have actually been able to cover quite a lot of types, which is a really good thing. You know, this feels like a mismatch in a way right now. I know. Okay, never mind. It's not a mismatch. Anyway, aside from being sidetracked, I have been covered. What the? I've been able to cover the mod. <laughs> the majority. <laughs> of the types be able to just combat them all it's been great eevee's cover you can totally beat the game with just eevee's how many times is magmar just gonna run into me i was searching magmars earlier now magmars are running towards me this is ironic and we're now in the basement seems like an interesting place they probably did research here right wow dodged the bullet there wait is that a dinner right there i'm just noticing that i'm gonna use a silver raspberry because why not why'd you go all the way over there okay i'm gonna throw why did you go that way? All right, go that way now. There we go. Oh, come on. All right, it was pretty active, so we're probably gonna have to make it calm down. Why? Come on, get in. Get in there, stay in there. I'm using another one. Why'd you still hop over? Why'd you still hop over? Get in the ball. What are you doing? Why? Get in there. Oh, go. Ooh, this thing does not want to be caught. Stay in there. Stay in there. Stay in there. Yes, you are mine. Saw a closed door over back there, so we're going to have to open it. I'm going to have to battle that trainer now, though, because I closed that door once I came in. Or he just dodges a bullet again. Another scientist. Hey! Woohoo! I did so much damage. And it's paralyzed. Sure. All right, we're going to have to swap out. Just need one bite. One bite. And he uses screech. Sure. You love to see that, you love to see that. Now you just quick attack it to oblivion. Whoa. How can one elected us be so much trouble? Ah! So I'm not really that surprised, in all honesty, that I didn't white out yet because it's just Eevees and I've been just kind of dominating. I found a secret key to what though? We are gonna have to find that door. Why do I keep running in a wild Pokemon? <laughs> now we just gotta find wherever that secret key is used for. <laughs> is this the one? No. Is this the door I'm looking for? Nope. Where's the secret key go to? I give up. I couldn't find it. So I'm just gonna go to the gym now. It's not my turn yet? Oh, I had to find that secret key. Noted. Well, go, let's go straight into the battles. Ushu is at the front, right? Yeah, okay, we're good. I don't know why I'm so nervous about nothing, really. Oh, I'm gonna blame off. I win. Wow, totally not a narcissist. First question. Which of these is Spitfire? Magmar, right? Yay! How many gym badges are certified by the Pokemon League? Eight. Yay. Third question. A seal type move used on fire Pokemon will be not very effective. Yay, yay, yay. True or false? PM28 contains move Tombstoney. Yeah, what is that? That's just false. Yeah, 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 yeah. Last question. Who are you about to battle? Blank. We have five Eggmen. And they exploded. It's the real Blaine. Hope you brought some burn heals. Here's what's gonna happen though. We're just gonna blow away all of them. Give me one skull. One hit. Arcanine is the second to go down. What comes after Arcanine? It's nothing but a rapid ash, which will also go down to Ushio skull. Like I said. And Nine Tails is last. Quiz time, Blaine. Who's the one that's about to lose to the power of the Vaporeon? That's right, you! No ashes remain from my... Uh, my... Uh, my power! And badge. Probably use that for Flareon. Yes! Oh, that'll be great. What do we replace, though? Mm, probably Iron Tail. The other evolutions know it. Oh, it's our rival coming to greet us. I beat Blaine! The Gym in Viridian City. You can do that in no time. We're just gonna go straight there with Sky Dash. Memory serves, Viridian City Gym is a ground type gym, and ground types hate water. What this? The door's locked. Place is never open. Who should we talk to? Professor Oak. Blue's here too. It's a keystone. We won't need it. What do you want? Where's it going? And the Viridian City Gym leader's back, just like that. I don't have to do anything, right? Yeah, I'm qualified. 
fact that they just shove you in the battles in this gym is kind of evil. I get that they want you to battle the trainers, but the fact that they just shove you into them, eh, I don't like that. Though I guess on the bright side, it does help for experience grinding. They just forced me to another one. And that's done. Oh, just like that. Surely defeat all these guys. Guys, we can surely defeat Giovanni using minimal effort, AKA Ushio, smirk. Wahaha, <laughs> welcome to my hideout. It shall be so until I can, yeah. Until I can restore Team Rocket to its former glory. This time I'm not holding back. Prepare for a world of pain. I shall not also hold back, which means no weak moves. Why is it here's the earthquake right away? How's it faster? Good. Now for Nido King, which shall also go down in one smack. <laughs> you dare stand up to the power of a Vaporeon with crazy special attack? Nido Queen? Nah, bro. That's also going down in one smack. I... Now nah, we're good. Smack dead. A truly intense fight. I put barely any effort into that. Yet again, I am defeated. As proof of your victory, here's the Earth Badge. Wow, I can challenge the Pokemon League now. And I got Earthquake, which I probably won't even be using. I can't face my followers after being defeated like this. Team Rocket is finished. And off he goes. Salute the best team, boss. Farewell. And he's gone forever. Well, I do say, though, that is the end of this episode. Hit the pause button. Not literally. Please, keep watching the video. I never thought a criminal would use a Pokemon Gym as their hideout. That decided. Blue will look after Viridian City Gym. Yay! And resume. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. In the next episode, we'll be sure to tackle the Pokemon League. And if you guys are interested, we'll do a bit of a post-game content. But for now, that'll be all. We'll see you next time. Peace!